uh, raise your right Senators hand. made it clear to the three executives sitting before them they and their companies will be held responsible for the oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico. I don't believe it's adequate to simply chalk what happened up to a view that accidents do happen. I would suggest to all three of you that we are all in this together because this incident is affecting, will have impact on the development of our energy policy for this country. Two Senate panels grilled BP's president, the CEO of Transocean, and a president from Halliburton about the roles each of their companies was playing in the offshore drilling rig that exploded and sank last month. Will BP pay? We're going to pay the claims, and, we're, and the entire resources of BP are behind this. When the senators attempted to pinpoint who might be to blame for the explosion that killed 11 rig workers, each executive tried to say another company was probably at fault. I hear one message, and the message is, don't blame me. Well, shifting this blame does not get us very far. And finally, the president of BP said his company would make things right. We are a responsible party. Our obligation is to deal with, deal with the spill. As senators looked at whether more government regulation was necessary, the round-the-clock cleanup effort continued in the Gulf. 210,000 gallons of crude a day are spilling into the water, and crews are still working to stop the flow. Joel Brown, CBS News, Washington.